What's up everybody, Toad Beats Guy here, back with WWE All-Stars? That's right, we're playing WWE All-Stars. Um, I had this idea, well actually it wasn't my idea, I stole it from my friend Mr. Arrow HD, also known as Keenan, whatever you want to call him. Uh, he does racing stuff on YouTube, if you want to check out his channel, link is in the description. But he does this uh, idea, which is not a new idea, it's called uh, Throwback Thursday, he plays old games. And I figured, why not bring Throwback Thursday back to my channel for like a, a, a wrestling throwback? Because there's a lot of really good old school wrestling games. And I figured that uh, I would go back to a game that's still on the Xbox 360. I thought it was one of the greatest wrestling games that came out in the modern era. It was a lot better. There's 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 so much moves in this game that are, are indie-rific that I just love. Like that Orton neckbreaker. I don't think he's done that in a long... I can't remember the last time he did that. That uh, powerbomb to neckbreaker move. That's such a great move. That's, that's right out of DDP's playbook and I love it. Anyway, uh, so, so I had this idea. Throwback Thursday, we go all Thursday. I want to get back into playing the games and all the good stuff that you guys like to see. So Throwback Thursday, I figured I would come in and play some old wrestling games. Now, I really don't have a format for the show, how I want to do it, but I figured Thursday we could play old games. So that's where you guys can come in. You can let me know in the comment section below what kind of games you want me to play. And you know what we'll do is we will go based off of whatever the top comment is. That's how it's going to go. So leave a top comment right now on what game you want to see me play next Thursday and kind of like a motor how you want me to do it would you like me rather to do a live commentary on it would you like me to do a commentary like this where I talk about the game we could talk about wrestling we could even go back and just talk about what's going on in the in the old school days of wrestling whichever game you guys want to see I'm gonna try and do like one different game unless you guys get into say you want a series like I could go back to no mercy and play one of their story modes or here comes the paints I don't know what you guys want to see but I figured you know what throws back throwback thursday excuse me i'm watching warrior come off the screen and this is crazy i can't believe you can go all the way across the ring and get you there's no way you can avoid that move it's 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 crazy anyway but uh I, for this throwback thursday i'm kind of leaving it up to you guys let me know what you guys want to see uh so top comment uh, most thumbs up uh that will be the one that will win so let me know what you guys think uh throwback thursday i think it's a great idea i really do love it i think uh It'll be great for you guys who love the old school games. Even this game right here. If you've never played WWE All-Stars, you should go play it. It is a great game. It's on Xbox 360. It's on PS3. Unfortunately, the studio that made this game is no longer around anymore. And I don't think that 2K Sports picked it up. But honestly, like I said, this is one of the most fun wrestling games that I have ever played. I'm, I'm going to be legit with you. This is, this is one of the most fun. Look at this RKO. It is ridiculous. You can do it out of anything. And that's what I love about this game, that they don't have this in any current game right now, is the ability to counter moves mid-move. Like right here. Go for the neckbreaker. Counter. Nope, you can't. Well, you could, but he didn't. So that's what I really loved about this game, is the, is the ability to counter at any point. And here goes Warrior with his signature. Oh, it just tosses me down. But I, I think it's uh, it's such a great game. It's such a great concept. I mean, when I first saw it, I was like, what? They're all rutted out. It's really weird. It's stupid. I don't think I like it. But you play it, and it's just such a smooth playing game. I even know Yard thinks it's awesome. I think, I don't know if Tubby really likes it, but I know that It's My Yard is a huge fan of it. And I think it's great. I think it's, it's such, such a great concept for a game. I know the idea was Legends versus Current Gen, um, and that's what they were going for here. But... I think if you take this concept, you don't even have to make it as arcadey as you, as this is. I mean, you can. I really like the arcadiness. I like the style of it. I think I think it's got a charm to it that most wrestling games don't have today. But I think if you could do something like this right now with a with you know release it on Xbox Live, release it on PSN, you would be so it would be perfect. It would be awesome. Releases make a game like this. Release it for. $20, maybe $20, $25. I don't even know what the price is. Let's say $15 to $20. $10 to $20. Let's do that. Let's release a game like this. Um, you can include characters later on if you want. You can even release it at full price for all I care. But I do think that this is such a good enough concept where we got the reversals. We get the, the arcade wrestling style that we want to see. Because the WWE games are supposed to be simulation. And that's what they're supposed to be. You're supposed to be able to simulate good matches and have good good fun with it. But if you make an arcade style wrestling game just like this again. You don't even have to call it All-Stars or whatever you want to call it. But I think, I think the concept right there is good enough not to do it right now. 
I think uh, it would be great to have a little change in the WWE games atmosphere right now with the, the 2K14 getting kind of stale. Honestly, it is getting kind of stale. I, I don't know if I really even uh, fully like that game anymore, but that's another day for another opinion. That's why we're throwing it back every Thursday. WWE All-Stars, I win with the RKO push-ups for the win. Anyway, guys, like I said, leave a comment what you want to see me play next week. Uh, game and mode. Most thumbs up one will win. Tony Pete's guy. Rag